it's all about awareness, no doubt. Um, even what Yvonne just said about letting things happen, I've been trying to chase a job that I didn't want. And that was a month ago when I was just meeting Brad and it was the wrong time and I wasn't in a good place. And now that I'm in a good place, things are happening. I reached out a couple of people yesterday and it's like, this is incredible. It's amazing. I'm actually going to probably find something that is going to fulfill me that I'm not going to be miserable in. It's just awesome. 17 days ago, I did my hypnosis session with Brad and it uncovered so many things in my path that were traumatic for me and and just got those all out and gone. It's incredible to see Doug and Heather on this call. Six weeks, actually by five weeks ago, my life was total rock bottom. And I remember when I talked to Brad the first time, I couldn't even talk to him without crying. I, I was beside myself, right? You're brand new to this. That was me a month ago. This stuff that Brad, if you put in the work and just and just do it, just do the stuff that you you need to do every day. You're going to get so much out of it. I'm so excited for you guys because I was there, and now it's like I just can't wait to get my day started now. Whereas before, it was like it was just the worst. So that's all I'll say. And again, just have fun with it. And um, Brad's got a hell of a program. I just can't say enough about it. It's awesome. I would go out to a I would go out to a restaurant because I want to watch a football game, a college football game. I was telling Brad about this, this the other day. Last Saturday night, I went out by myself. A younger couple sat next to me. I'm now totally approachable, whereas before I wasn't. I kind of have this glow about me now. People want to be around me. They like me. I have. I would have never talked to these people next to me, and now we just have the most incredible conversations. They want to hear about what I have to say. I want to hear what they have to say. It's just an awesome way to now go through life. 56, it, year, 56 years, I just, I thought I was doing really great, but I had no idea until these last, let's see, let me add this up. Let me get this exactly right. These last 16 days. I've been basically reborn 16 days ago. There were, there were some things that I wasn't sexually abused or anything like that, but there were some pretty traumatic things that happened to me when I was little. I just did not get enough love from my my parents and my family. Um, Brad was able to help me recognize that, pull it out of me. It's gone. And now I can live my life the way I need to. It's just, it's awesome. I can't say enough about it. You're bringing out the best in me. You helped me get where I needed to be. I thought, I thought hypnosis was actually, I had a preconceived notion that I wouldn't really be able to, um, control what I was saying. I, it's weird. Uh, it's nothing that I thought it was going to be, but it was, it was just amazing, Brad. Um, but yeah, my, my head, it feels, it almost feels like everything between here is, is lined up differently. That, uh, recording you did right there, that really hit the notes for me. I mean, that is going to be something I'm going to be able to listen to and really enjoy and make my day. I can't wait to start listening to that and um, doing that. There's no stress intention. Like I, I know I did yoga this morning and had a pretty good, I mean, it's just, you know, the cliche, I'm a new man. Like I, I feel like a new man. Like awesome. my eyes, like I'm, I'm even seeing stuff. Like I have this wonderful picture of my two kids up above the uh, fireplace in my apartment. They got their arms back like this, like that even looks better. And that's like my favorite thing to look at. I remember when I asked you to send me your credentials because my wife wanted to look at them and I'm reading them. I'm like, wow, look at all these hours that you spent, like thousands of hours, right? Like just trying to, it's, you know, what I used to do for my career, I, I basically summed it up in one sentence. I helped people. I'm like, you're, you're helping people. Like, it must feel so awesome that like you, you and I met, right, three weeks ago. And now here we are three weeks later, and then maybe another week or two, you're going to meet somebody else similar, kind of like me, and they're going to go through the same thing. And it's just, it's got to be such an awesome thing for you to just watch that happen. The texts that I send them, there are these phrases I borrowed from you. There are 66 good things to tell your kid. I actually took two of them last night and like made them, I didn't want to overload on, on one text, but it was still short. It was just two of them. I can't remember what they were. I could probably scroll back and tell you. But he's like, he replied back. He goes, Dad, he goes, it's just, you're the only one that says this to me. He goes, this is so nice of you. Like he just, he's getting something out of it. 
based on your website, you're going back to your childhood. These are excuses that you're coming up with. They're not excuses. They're, this is real stuff. I mean, Brett, you should see the conversations I'm having at restaurants with people, gym, grocery stores. It is, I would never go up to these people. And now I'm just like, here's the best part, I think. They're coming up to me. Like they want to be around me. They can see something. I'm not making this up. I'm not telling you this just because I'm supposed to get something out of this program and this is all supposed to work or not work. I'll be sitting there at my locker at the gym and a guy will come up to me and want to talk to me because I think he sees that there's a comfort in me or a glow or something. I'm approachable now, whereas before I was this wilted little flower that just didn't want to blossom, you know? I can see the power of this and how it's working and the, those recordings, the recording you made for me, oh my God, like, it's it's changing me like I can just feel it since the hypnosis session. OK, like I felt I feel like a new person. I am a new person. I'm a great person. I love myself at the front desk at the yoga place. These two instructors, um, I know them really well. They I've talked to them about this whole process I'm going through because I just can't. I just I've been sharing it with so many people because it makes me feel better. I told them all about the hypnosis like they, they can even see a difference in me when I walk in. They're like you just look totally different to us. Like, wow. And I say, I look at them and I go, you are both amazing. Like, look at you. And like, I can't stop looking at them. And I just look at people now and I'm like, everybody's amazing, Brad. Like they're all awesome. And I'm not making it up. I wish I was. It's just one of those things where in the past, I would never approach anybody like that. I would just go get my drink, sit down, not make eye contact with anybody, just put my head down and just and now the people that are sitting around me at breakfast, we're striking up conversations, talking about the game, talking about this and that and this and that. It's amazing. And these people are like really happy and they're in love. And I told you this on a text. It's just, it's, it's amazing. And I wasn't like that for so long. What the heck? 99.9% .9 of me just feels unbelievable, amazing. And five weeks ago, it was just like, I, I was just such a mess. I couldn't stand it. So here, here we are. The first two coaching sessions, I just sat there. I just, I didn't even want anybody to look at me. I just wanted to try to get through that hour and maybe take some notes and get something out of it. Now look at this. I can't, I'm just bubbling and, and just immensely grateful for, you know, just, just the five weeks that you've helped me with, Brad. I mean, just the two of us doing this. I remember vividly the hypnosis session on September, I used to know the date, 13th. I should commit that to memory because that was a big day for me. When you pulled the demon out of me, and I'm actually starting to tear up about it now. And I said to you, you did it. Brad, you freaking did it. And I could literally feel it coming out and it was gone. And, you know, you did it and we did it. Could rate this program on a scale of one to 10? Oh, yeah, 10, 100%. Yeah, this is, this is, it's, oh, it's 10 plus. Yeah. What, what could I have done better? Boy, you've you've gone above and beyond. Um, the, the, again, I said this at the beginning that the just and I'm not going to text you all the time. I, I promise I'm going to leave you alone. You're a busy guy. When I send you a text, it'll be because I really need a, a response just to run by you. But just knowing that you're there, you've been there for me. There's there's counseling and there's coaches and but there then there's you. There's somebody who. I can tell a BS or you are truly interested in helping all of those people every Thursday or Friday in those group coaching sessions, um, given empowering Yvonne to help people. Um, now you may be empowering me to try to help people on the Facebook page. I'm not a Facebooker, but let's see how I can navigate through this. It, what could you have done better? Um, nothing. I mean, I just, I got, I never thought I would get this much out of something in five weeks. Really, in the last two weeks, I'm coming to these meetings, group session four and five, and I'm saying to myself, what are we going to go over other than reinforcement? You know, you promised, you didn't promise, you said this is your, my program's a five-week program. Everybody's got to be skeptical about that. And then there's a hypnosis session. Oh my God, I've never done that. Like, how am I going to, no chance. I'm not, I'm, that's not going to happen. And then it's, I'm going in a million directions here because I got so many thoughts going through my head and I know you're busy. It, I mean, you, you really, we did it in three, three and a half, less than four weeks. And knowing, knowing now what you know, what would you have paid for the program? Oh, geez. 
what would I, you know, I had, I actually thought about that and I said something to you, I think at the beginning of session four that you, or at the end, I said, Brad, you don't charge enough. And you just kind of looked at me. You've got to charge a price that won't scare people off, but. But forget that say, part. Forget that part. What would you now knowing how your life is and what the next 56 double, years may look like? Double. Yeah. I would double. Yeah. I, I double. Like, I, I mean, seriously, if people are ever doubting what they should, what they should pay for this. And then you start doing the math, 15 grand, five weeks. I mean, gosh, that's three grand a week. That's a lot of money. I think there'll be a time I mean, in your Brad, life. Brad, you I, got my, back. I got my life back for, for $8,000, Brad. I mean, really? I mean, that's come on. Eight grand got my whole life back.